Hey, what's up guys? Jesus here. Welcome back to Let's Play Legend of Zelda Twilight Princess. In the last episode, we saved the kids from the Bulbins once again. Or, well, we didn't really save them from the Bulbins the last time they invaded, but we encountered the Bulbins once again, and this time we saved the kids from them. And... Uh, some other stuff. I really don't feel like recalling it all off the top of my head. If you want, if you don't know what happened, if you haven't seen the last episode, feel free to go ahead and check it out. Hit, just hit pause. I'll be here waiting. But right now, we are going to make our way up Death Mountain. Hey. Hey, uh, this is what I've been waiting for. Finally got ourselves a fucking decent shield. However, this is the last shield upgrade that we get in the game. This is the best shield that we get. But I'm fine with that, because it is, it is the best shield. feel more like Link with this shield now. Okay, so now we're going to make our way to the outskirts of Kakariko to Death Mountain, where if you remember a couple episodes ago, we tried making our way up Death Mountain, and we were forced off by a Goron. But things are going to be a little different this time around since we've got the Iron Boots. We'll see how things go here. Hmm. <laughs> oh, you're back again, human? You'll never pass. You can't hope to match our brute force. Well, but I I just want to talk. If you just let me talk, I. Okay, fine. He didn't want to talk. I did what I had to. Oh, there's another one. That's right, they, they just keep on coming. You gotta just take them out as you go. I love how the iron boots don't weigh you down when you're not wearing them. Like, if you're wearing them, you weigh a ton, and it it's just so heavy to even lift your feet, but then once you take them off, you move normally as though you're not even carrying them. It's like, wait, I have them in my inventory, I am carrying them, shouldn't it weigh me down just as much? You'd think that. Not in this game, though. This is an Elder Scrolls. Weight is not a factor. <laughs> I'm sure in a game like Elder Scrolls, something like that would definitely, like, oh, you acquired the Iron Boots, it adds 450 kilograms to your total weight that you're carrying, so you can't carry dick else. Fuck that. Oh my god, everybody's shooting at me. Ow. Ow. Fuck off. Fuck. Fuck off. Ow. Ah. <laughs> Assholes, they're lucky I don't have a bow. Shoot them all in the face. Oh, come on. Really? Is that necessary? Alright, hearts. <clears throat> Yeah, hi, I see you. Ew, what are they, oh. It's like, what are they doing? Gross. Well, that's good to know. I'll take that. Now, I'm pretty sure I need to let all these things fall 
Ow. Oh, don't mind me. There it is. There's the big motherfucker. Damn. Well, looks dangerous. Okay, and with that done, now we can... Aha, fuck you. Thank you, Shield Bash. Alright. Hello. <laughs> you suck. Fucking Gorons. Up we go. Huh. Okay then. Do, 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 do. Just go up this way. Fuck you, Steam. There we go. Hello. Whee! Excuse me. Just passing through. You mind? Oh crap. Ooh. That was lucky. I was not even expecting that. The fuck out of my kitchen. <laughs> oh, did you hurt your little fingers? Yep. Oh, you dick. <laughs> Fucking asshole. <laughs> Fuck you. Come on. What the hell is that? Prick. Just let me up. Thank you. Hearts. Hearts. Alright. Make sure I put those boots on before I enter. <laughs> Otherwise, I'll lose. Clomp, 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 clomp. Nobody notices anything's amiss when I come clomping in. What? No, all humans wear obnoxiously loud, clanky boots like that. <laughs> Such an imposing enemy, you must all gang about him? I think not, little brothers. Clomp, clomp, clomp. Goron Elder, a little human called Gor Koron. Because of certain circumstances, I must leave the Goron tribe in place of Dar Darbus, our tribal patriarch. I almost said Darunia. Tell me, little human, do you come from the village below? You've done well to come this far. You are strong for a human. <laughs> However, ba -ba -bum. the mines beyond here are sacred to my tribe. Outsiders are not allowed, unless... Hmm. Hmm. I could make an exception, but you would have to beat me in a contest of power. Are you willing to try that, little human? You fucking better believe it. This is what I was training for with Half Naked Bow in the last video. Your Goron beer belly and saggy rock tits are nothing new to me after training with Bow. Clank. Now you'd think one of the Gorons would be like, hey, shouldn't he take those boots off? No. They're all stupid. <laughs> Smack. 
That, that was over really quickly. I thought it was going to take longer than that. <laughs> oh, well. Fine traits. Want to see how well you can use them? You could have seen it, I'd bet the mountain erupting without pause. When the mountain began to rage, all four of us elders and Darbus, our patriarch, went inside to investigate its anchor. We have a treasure entrusted to us by the spirits, and we must protect it. Do you understand? The moment Darbus reached out and touched the treasure, everything went wrong. He collapsed, and before our very eyes transformed to an unspeakable monster. He began to rage through the mines, trailing Gruen behind him, and the eruptions grew more frequent and more severe. We used all of our strength to seal him deep inside the mountain. It grieved us to do this to our patriarch. We had no other course of action. I ask this favor of you, young warrior. Go to the aid of Darvis. Make no mistake, the spirits have guided you here. I, Gorkoron, need your help. Me and my saggy rock tits. On behalf of my entire clan, I ask you for our aid. Your aid. You too. Let the young warrior pass. Okay. I'll just be on my way in my absolutely normal, non-weighted down boots that don't seem like they're weighed down at all in any way. They're just normal boots. I'll see ya. <laughs> oh, man. With the sumo wrestling out of the way and finally gaining access to the Goron Mines, I think I'm going to go ahead and end the episode here. So be sure to tune in for the next episode when we begin to tackle the Goron Mines. Until then, make sure to like favorite the video if you enjoyed it. Let me know what you thought in the comments section down below. Be sure to subscribe if you haven't already. And as always, thank you for watching. <laughs>